Hey, what's up guys? It's Neil here with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to customize your iPhone's home screen layout without jailbreak. The only requirement for this process to work is that you need an iPhone 5 or above model, so you can have all the way up to a 6 Plus. Once you've made certain that your device fits the requirements, head into Safari, and we're going to navigate to the web service or web app called Makeover without the E before the final R dot IO. Now from here it's pretty uh, self-explanatory. They give you some pretty basic instructions, but we'll go over them together. <coughs> so you're going to want to go down and the first step actually requires you to choose a background. Now from here the process will differ. If you want to use a fresh background, meaning use one of theirs, you can actually just scroll through them. They don't have that many, but they have a few you can choose from. You would just select it, tap and hold to save it. I'm not going to save it right now. Once you do, it'll actually tell you just exit Safari, set it as your wallpaper with perspective zoom off, and pinch to zoom out just to make sure. And then you would just apply it and then come back to this page as it's telling you. Now, if you want to use your own wallpaper, you're going to go ahead and apply it. I have mine already. It's just a picture of my girlfriend. You're going to enter edit mode. Swipe to the right so you get a blank page. Now using the home and power button simultaneously, I'm going to take a screenshot. And then we're going to go back into the service and say that I'm going to use my own. Now from here, I would just upload that screenshot that I just took. Now from here, the application will do its magic where it essentially is creating um, placeholders using cutouts of my screenshot. So as you can see, it has the grid that is, that is your home screen and it has the individual app cutouts or application actual icons themselves cutouts using my wallpaper. So now I would just get the desired icon I want. Say I want to use this one. I will just tap on it till it's outlined, use this export option, and I'm going to select add to home screen. Now when it asks for a name or a label, you just put nothing and just hit add. And you'll see right here I have this icon. I'm just going to place it where it goes. And you can barely tell, actually you can't even tell at all that there's an app right there unless you actually do that. So then you would go back and you repeat this process, grabbing the ones you want and strategically placing them wherever you need to to achieve the look that you're going for. So I'm about done here. It took me a good, I want to say two minutes, but I finally got my screen looking the way I want. Um, it's definitely unique, it's different than the way I had it, and you can't really tell that I have those placeholders unless you move the screen and you can see that cool effect, or if I bring up my my uh, app switcher you can see those placeholders but um yeah it's pretty awesome because you don't have to be jailbroken so don't worry about needing a jailbreak anymore you can just use this little trick um, depending on what you're trying to achieve it might take a little while but it's better than trying to jailbreak just for this one aspect but uh, definitely check out the full guide on gadgethacks.com also don't forget to like comment and definitely subscribe for some more awesome and real useful gadget hack videos thanks guys